today on News 5. Hello, I'm Jessie Nisbet and I'm here at Channel 5 Studio to interview Marlene Cuellar. Welcome to Channel 5, Jessie. Thanks. When you were my age, did you think you would be a news anchor? How old are you? Seven. Seven. When I was seven, I definitely didn't know I was going to be a news anchor. Um, I actually... I think probably at that time I knew that I wanted to work with kids. I didn't think TV was going to be my thing, but I used to talk a lot from then anyway. My teachers used to tell me that all the time. What is one thing you would want people to know about you? Well, um, like I just said, I really like working with kids. And uh, it all started when I was in upper school. And uh, my principal, well, all, like I said, all my teachers used to complain that Marlene talks too much in class, and I had a lot of energy. And uh, my principal sat me down one day and said, Marlene, I know what you're going to do. There's this group of kids that meet with UNICEF, and I want you to be a part of it since you like to talk so much. So I went to represent the school, and uh, through that, I started to do some stuff from t on TV when I was 11. And I was so nervous. I mean, and, and that's probably why I never thought I was going to end up on TV again. Because it's really scary when you're a kid and you, you get in front of a camera and everybody's watching. It's a really scary deal. Um, so I don't think a lot of people know that, that I started very early with, with some of the TV stuff. Is your job difficult? My job is different. Um, I have very, very early mornings. You came here one time with your mom and dad. It's pretty early, right? Yeah. So I have to wake up very early in the morning and get ready and come to work. And every single day is different. Every single day I do something completely different from the day before. Um, and then at the end of every day, when everybody goes home from a regular, from a regular job, I get ready to come back to work again and to be able to deliver the news. And um, so I don't think it's difficult. Uh, I like the fact that it's so different. If you could go back in time and meet yourself at my age, what advice would you give yourself? <gasps> I would probably tell myself to not be so scared about doing new things. I think when we're really little, a lot of times uh, people tell us things that we should do and uh, what's, what's going to be best for us. And sometimes we're kind of scared to talk about how we feel um, and, and what we think is best for us. And I always think that, especially when I talk to younger kids, I always tell them that they have to be able to say uh, what they like, what they don't like, always in a respectful way. Um, but that you can start to express yourself from really early, just like you're doing. Mm -hmm. Anything else you want to ask me? Mm. Yeah. Was that hard? No. No? You enjoyed it? Yes. Do you think you're going to be a reporter now? I don't know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What do you want to be when you grow up? I want to own a business. Mm -hmm. What kind of business? I don't, I, I don't know yet. Okay. Well, I'm going to look out for that then, Jessie. Thank you for talking with me, Marlene. Absolutely no problem. Did you enjoy it? Yes, I did. Okay. Good. Thank you, too. Bye!